We were young yeshiva boys way back in 65 We were known throughout the city as the bums from the east side In school we never studied, all we did was laugh and play No Rebbe ever lasted long, they all just ran away Rebbe tried to teach us Torah each and every day we just closed our eyes and ears to everything he'd say And all we like to do was sit and watch our TV sets we talk about the Yankees and the Dodgers and the Mets Well the principal brought the new Rebbe in the first day of the term And he said to him, show discipline, be strong and tough and firm Don't think these youngsters run a school, he said with a big frown by the way, for the next few weeks, I'm going out of town. But this here Rebbe, he was strange. He never lost his cool. He just kept on teaching while we broke all the rules. And though we hadn't even learned a single word all year, it was Pesach time already, and the Rebbe was still here. Rebbe tried to teach us Torah each and every day. We just closed our eyes and ears to everything he'd say And all we like to do was sit and watch our TV sets we talk about the Yankees and the Dodgers and the Mets When Lagba Omer came around, it was time to play that game Against those boys from Brooklyn, how we prayed it wouldn't rain All nine of us got on the bus with our gloves and bats Reddy also came along in his jacket, tie and hat Right from the start we all could see things weren't going right Some big strong kid from Bensonhurst had hit one out of sight And just when things were looking up Tied about to turn, our catcher went and broke his leg while sliding into third. It's a forfeit, cried the other team, you only got eight guys. No we don't, a deep voice said, much to our surprise. And since I am their Rebbe, well the fair thing it would seem, is let me be the ninth man, the ninth man on this team. Rebbe went, picked up a bat, faced the pitcher with a smile. Knocked the cover off that ball, went about half a mile. He flew around the bases to score the winning run. We danced and cheered until he said, now boys, you owe me one. The next day in the classroom, no one moved and no one stirred. Rebbe started teaching, and his voice, it could be heard. We all said, hey, it's interesting. The man, he is no bore. The legendary East Side bums were gone forevermore. Rebbe used to teach us Torah each and every day. We opened up our eyes and ears to everything he'd say. No more did we sit all day and watch our TV sets. We talked about the Rashi and the Tosfos 